hi friend in this video i am tell about the timestamp same time value the basically timestamp same times referencing the are used for time check the application response time check web app server response time and check any source to destination response time it is very helpful to solving problem how many network latency are present in the whole network or subnet there is the wire in this wire shark there is the many types of reference available the relative the absolute timing the current time date stamps it is the also help to improve the network or troubleshoot the network problem so in the wire shark i am tell about the how wire shark will be help to solving problem or determining times or checking the times for packets and other troubleshooting purpose so i am clicking on the local area connection and click on the start and capture some packets so here i am some another traffic so i am open the all program and open command prompt from accessories i am using here basic ping for your router so i am typing 192.168.8.1 i am provide the router gateway address and hitting end the applies come from the router so i am clicking on close this window and stop the capturing and i am here type the pings packet type so a packet is the basically ping request will be icmp packet internet control message protocol packet so i am clicking the icmp filter and hit enter so here is the checking the basically time the echo request echo reply how many times spent on the request and how many time get reply from back so here are the time stamps it will be you can change the time apply the time display format in the view panel and go to time and display format and here you can select the second since beginning the capture previous capture it and if i am selecting the by default second since beginning of the capture it will be time of the when the capture start from beginning and end from beginning it is the time so this echo request will be sent the 23 millisecond after starting of this capturing so this echo request will be sent when capturing will be start and when capturing will be stop to here is a 23 milliseconds when the capturing is be start after starting this capture and 26 will be last apply form um, here if 23 second on 23 millisecond one echo request will be sent on 23 second 0.094 one millisecond reply back the network is here is the good performance in 0.01 millisecond reply back so here i am basically check the network can be troubleshooted or how much the network can be busy or how fastly reply back them from the server website or any other things so if i am click on the views and change the time display format and checking the again since previous capture time so here in this the first packet is send in 0.115 seconds and another reply back 000 seconds this is less than 00 millisecond so fast response so first again request and reply again request and reply so much fast reply the network is good from here but uh, you can check from another system if the replies come from the 10 milliseconds 12 milliseconds you can check this things for how the network will be problem you can check the network bandwidth network cables how much web servers supported gigabit ethernet how much how much network card will be busy web server will be busy load balancing are working or not you can check from here so another view in another thing say in the view panel if you can change the display time format or check in macro seconds and no second you can also choose the by default is automatically file positions i'm selecting to millisecond and then centi seconds be will be used it will automatically use in centi seconds you can use in your way 
so i am using basically milliseconds or nanoseconds it is depend on your traffic speed if you can more efficient your network traffic you can check into milliseconds and uh, optimize more network so this is the all about in the timestamps and time value so thanks guys for watching please subscribe my channel thanks thank you guys